Hey, it's episode two of week three, I Hit Send Sunday. I'm here with my co-host Oliver, and uh, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna try to answer this next question. This question comes from a guy named Andrew, and he says, Hey Steve, my name's Andrew. Let me start off by saying I'm so happy I found you a couple weeks ago. You're hilarious, and I can always count on you to bring a smile to my face. Well, I hope you're smiling right now, because your question is today's episode. <laughs> so I came out earlier this year, uh, the end of March, and my family was actually really great about it. No one has treated me any differently than before, other than my two older brothers making lighthearted gay jokes, which are rather funny, so I can't get mad. <laughs> Anyways, recently I've been talking to a guy I really like, but I'm scared to jump into a relationship because that'll involve bringing him home to meet the, pa uh, the family eventually. I've tried bringing up the whole gay topic to my parents, but they usually brush it off or will flat out tell me they don't want to talk about it. How should I go about talking to them about the situation, and is it too soon to bring a guy home to meet them? Thanks, Steve. Love the videos. Keep up the good work. Uh, thank you for calling it good work and not mediocre or medium work. Thank you very much. Uh, all right, let's talk about this. It sounds awesome that you know, you have your, your siblings on your side. You know, If they're making jokes about it or whatever, that's as brotherly as it gets. So um, it sounds like you have a good situation. I don't know about the parents though. I mean, I'm, I'm sorry that they shut you down every time you try to bring it up or they say they don't want to talk about it. Everyone takes these things in different ways. So maybe they're just mulling it over and acceptance is somewhere down the line. Um, I, I mean, hopefully that's the, the case, you know, hopefully, hopefully they just need some time to sort it out and, and make sure that you're serious. You met a guy. That's awesome. Uh, congratulations. Now you're worried about like running into a relationship. I would, I would, I would be too, you know, um, you're freshly out. You met a cool guy. Um, it might not be worth it to run into a relationship right away because you're freshly out and you have some exploring to do in terms of dating and figuring out what aspects of dating you like or what personality traits you look for, or what you you know want out of a relationship. Because I think everyone who's like closeted, we always picture this ideal day where we'll have a boyfriend and, and you know we'll have somebody who loves us and that we love. And then when we come out, we're like, all right, you, you'll do. <laughs> Instead of really being like, Instead of really being um, uh, picky, you know, and, and really getting what we want out of a relationship. I think dating other people helped me kind of respect what I have with my current boyfriend more because I realized what I didn't want from dating other people. So you might want to give yourself that that chance um, before you, you run into a relationship where, um, you know, you're kind of new to the game. Uh, as for bringing the guy home, yeah, I, I, dude, I, I hate to say this, but yeah, I feel like it's kind of too early. Because if your parents aren't ready to talk about it yet and they're not even willing to have the conversation with you, bringing a third party member into the household might not be the most comfortable thing for either one of you in terms of a couple and especially not for your parents who haven't even talked it out with you yet and now there's like this new guy in the household. Um, but you know, it sounds like your brothers are cool so maybe if you, if you wanna bring a guy around the family, bring him around the family who's cool with it so it's a, so it's a positive experience and not something that you guys will both kind of be like, potentially upset by if your parents don't have the reception that you were hoping for. Um, so yeah, bring them around your brothers as long as you can handle a couple gay jokes or whatever. Uh, I, I think that comes with the territory though. Um, but it, good for you, man. I mean, you, you came out, you, you've done you've done the hard work um, and you're talking to a guy, so that's awesome. Uh, so give your parents some more time, but it sounds like things are, things are going well. But I am gonna say it might be too early to bring the guy around the family, if not all of the family is super accepting right away. Um, you know, give us some time. Make sure it's a positive experience. Uh, yeah, and I hope that helps, Andrew. Uh, thank you so much for writing in, man. That means the world to me and Oliver. I know he doesn't talk much, but he like really appreciates it too. Um, all right, well, thank you so much. I'll talk to you soon, hopefully, and stay tuned for episode three.